George Chow, and I want to answer a question that was posted in my Facebook group by Laura. Thanks, Laura. Her question is, uh, do we need to use multiple social media platforms to create content, market our services? And here's, here are my thoughts on that. Um, if you had unlimited time and energy and interest, you would. Uh, because each of these pla- in, from each of these platforms, you'll reach different people, uh, different ideal clients. Um, you know, they, they hang out in different places. But you've got to respect your limits and to know that you don't have unlimited time. And so uh, remember, I have been doing full-time online marketing for this is my seventh year. And so I've had time to really build my rhythms into all this. And now I do post my content on Facebook fan page, group, profile, Twitter, LinkedIn, Google+, YouTube. But I would recommend that if you, unless you're already interested, um, passionate about using these different ones together, just start with one at a time. I would say test each one out for at least a month before you, try, before you, you know, make a judgment on it, on it. But the truth about it is that in every, each one of these platforms is so big. I mean, Facebook has 1.5 billion users that check in at least once a month. Uh, LinkedIn has, uh, well, last I checked, it was, uh, I think, close to half a billion. And, and Twitter has several hundred million. And Google Plus, of course, has several hundred million. Each of these, if you use it well, can bring you enough clients for the rest of your life. But it's, it, it needs to be used consistently and needs to be used in a smart way. It's not just about posting content. It's about engaging with others in a way, in my opinion, in a way that's truly service-oriented, that truly makes them feel cared for. So it's not just about posting things and waiting for clients to come to you. It's, uh, it's about seeing who responds, uh, seeing who comments and who likes your things, and then messaging them personally to say thank you and maybe see, hey, what, what are the questions going to help you with regarding this? How is it going? Which, you know, what issues are you dealing with your life? in your life or whatever you help people with that, uh, that I can help with. And then engaging with them in that way and if they, if they need ongoing help, then you suggest that maybe they can work with you in an official capacity, do an exploratory call. Um, it's also about finding people that seem ideal for your services or seem ideal to refer your services and reaching out to them in a, in a spirit of service. Say, I'd love to be of service to anyone that, uh, that deals with this particular issue. Please let me know and I'll help them out as much as I can. And, if, they're, if they seem like an ideal client, I'll, I'll make that offer to them. But either way, I just want to help people out. You see, so, um, and by the way, each one of these platforms, if you use them well, you'll, you'll learn skills that will transfer over to other platforms. It's sort of like the etiquette and the culture of it. So I hope this is helpful. Start with one at a time. Uh, use as many as you actually have interest and makes you happy. And remember to be doing outreach privately uh, on these platforms, not just posting things. Hope this is helpful. Oh, and also to, to be building community over time. That takes time as well. And uh, anyway, until the next video, I wish you well.